Hello and welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Mercantile for Championship, hosted by none other than Game Lord LK, who has been doing this for such a long time. Of course, the entire tournament is powered by none other than Samsung and energized by Red Bull. So talking about the Mercantile Esports Championship, it starts somewhere around the year of 2016, where Cameron LK brought together uh, the biggest names in the Mercantile industry to take part in the Esports Championship uh, to show who is the boss when it comes to the Mercantile sector and Esports as a whole. And uh, of course, this year is going to be no different. We have some of the uh, best companies taking part and today's grand finals for Mobile Legends is going to be no different with uh, one of the previous contenders. I can't remember whether they actually won or uh, what happened to them, but Global System Solutions was always up there in Mercantile Esports Championship. And they are today going up against Provina Electricals in the Mobile Legends uh, Championship Grand Finals. And uh, again, talking a little bit about our sponsors, Samsung is on board with Gamerod LK as our title sponsor for the Mercantile Esports Championship. And these guys are absolutely amazing. And if you are a mobile gamer, you know that there is no better phone to game on other than the Samsung, because it serves all purposes. If you want a really good camera, Samsung is the way to go. If you want the best possible performance in gaming, Samsung is the way to go. And when it comes to display, everyone knows there is no one better in the market for displays. And this Samsung S21, their newer series is no different with 120 hertz display coming on uh, coming on uh, to the phone and uh, without any uh, delay whatsoever let's get right into the game with our two casters so this is the grand finals for mobile legends between provina electricals and global system solutions well hello guys and we're taking over from tara thank you tara for that lovely introduction Okay, so we had the Mercantile Esports Championship. Uh, Kittinon, what do you think? What, what do you think of the rosters? Well, it looks pretty interesting. I don't know what I want to say about these names, though. I, I feel very concerned yeah. about the level of creativity. <laughs> yeah, let's see how Global System Solutions are planning to go up against Pravina Electricals. Pravina. And it seems Pravina Electricals have a five-member lineup, whereas the other team has a seven-member. Is it seven? Oh, no, it's six, right? With one sub. Let's yeah. see who, are, who the playing five is. Let's see. So I guess Let's we can move see. into the game now, right? It looks like, yeah. Okay, so we are at the draft pick phase. Let's see who they're planning to ban. Hmm, interesting. I feel like this match is going to be like one of the first times I've ever seen a match like this in a tournament. Excellent, excellent that statement, please. What? First well, time it's of what? really fascinating. Like, first time seeing a match like this in a tournament. It's the first time I'm seeing Popol and Hun. Ah, uh, I see, I see. First uh, time first I'm time seeing that. Day. <laughs> right. Cool, cool, understandable. Uh, yeah, we see a whale band, Hansu, Popol, which are not very popular bands at the moment, except for Pakito. I think that's a popular band. That's a very popular band, yeah. Hmm. But and even that, when pick. you go to... They're, oh yeah, they're going for a pretty good pick with the Roger. I believe this is the global side, right? And red is Pravina Electricals. Yeah, I believe that yes, is it correct. Is. If not, our bad. <laughs> oh, they've picked up a Johnson on the red side, which is 
like like i said you know like this is like a first for me in a tournament like i've never seen a johnson before in a tournament have you said oh. not not recently i used to <laughs> but not not in the you recent used to? yeah it, it, it johnson used to be meta in back in the day back in those tournaments okay, you may have been meta but how do you play him in a tournament that's what i've always wondered he used to be op Mm-hmm. Like the 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 team that picks up Johnson used to like win like every match because you now only like... you can see him like coming on the map. Those this okay. not really you can't. That's <laughs> the price car coming towards you. Oh wow! I see. I see. Well, it looks like Blue Side have picked up a Tig as their tank and an MM Leslie. while the red side have picked up an alu jungle which mm-hmm. i think is a very good combo for a johnson tank to be honest to be very frank also i'll be and... here for a few minutes so kitty no one can carry out those few minutes okay let's go awesome and now we have sahil going afk on us like i mean really sahil <laughs> we see that cecilia and louis have been banned which is again very a first for me red side picking up anana and deciding which mm to take when i like that the blue side has taken a eudora with the pig combo that looks like actual aids ooh and red side taking the clint as last pick wow it's a very interesting very very interesting So guys it looks like we're going into the first match of this round and good luck to both teams i guess this match Oh it seems that Nana is using the support emblem pull yourself together is she expecting to die a lot or is she expecting to spam Spam flame shot. Hmm, very fascinating. Okay, I'm I'm really curious about this Nana right now. Ah, I have to say I know nothing about these teams, so this is a first for me. Very interesting. The first few seconds of the match has started. Okay. And it looks like Roger and Alucard have both chosen to go for the red buff first. and i have returned and sahiru has returned mhm but did we i have miss na- in pravina electricals we have a nana with support emblem i see mm-hmm. is this the, is this the new meta <laughs> is, is this the i am going to feed nana is this the nana feed strategy or is this the flame shot spam strategy I'm very curious. <laughs> Can you remember we we were introduced to the Hanavi meta just recently in the was it the inter school sir? I think it oh, yeah it was the inter school. Oh yes. The Hanavi physical meta. Okay, so <laughs> now today we are going to be introduced to the <laughs> Nana meta. Pull yourselves together, <laughs> meta. Oh, I we can see the. It looks team like red team asking, for, asking a for a pause. Yeah, that's what. One minute and twenty-seven seconds into the game, and they decided to lag. I see. Oh, oh no! That was a short lag. Okay, maybe it was like a just a minor technical error, probably. Yeah. Probably. Yeah. Probably. Okay, so, you can see Alu looking to yeah. gang for or in the jungle. One of the two, whichever he is more convenient for him, basically. Okay, I think. I'll and looks like first blood going. Oh, oh, Ooh, nice bird. Ooh. 
I I actually thought the Khalid will get, would get the kill, but no. Same. Sun, I thought Sun the son was other gonna friend. totally die. <laughs> With you mean the son, right? Not the son. Who son? How? Explain. <laughs> you know how the game used to be like soon. Whenever like someone would pick son, no, it was son. <laughs> no, it would say like a weird version of soon. It was so fascinating. I call him soon. Okay, what does S U N stand for? You can still say soon, okay? Mm-hmm. In Chinese, mm-hmm. in Chinese culture, they say Sun Goku. Mm-hmm. Not Sun Goku. Unless you are saying S O N Sun Goku, you know. Mm-hmm. Like Did that. Know. Did I not see, that actually orbited around soon. The soon. <laughs> Uh-huh. Interesting. Have you noticed something though? Nobody went mm-hmm. for Lito. NASA has I sent mean. her the chat. Oh, it looks like. <laughs> Ooh, it looks like uh, Johnson see, has see, just you done see. his first crash. You oh, see, you see, this is what I'm talking about. But this is actually a visible Johnson on the map, not like. Oh, maybe like this. Does this emblem also reduce the CD of skills? No, right. Uh, the Nana. Emblem is it? Yeah. Only the resurrection time and plus the flame shot time, right? The flame the uh, yeah, that's yeah, what the, the yeah. battle. Okay, we can wait. The Roger is actually doing some good farming. It's a decent mm-hmm. farming. Even the Alu is farming and ganking really well, actually. Also, you know, your latest, there, you can see yeah. the... I think your latest recruit is playing Alucard. <laughs> My latest recruit. <laughs> yeah, for your girls team. Right? I see, I see. <laughs> this Sashi. Careful, Sashi. Vijayman has eyes on you. <laughs> <laughs> Sashi should probably fear for her life. <laughs> yes. Mm, oh, nice. Oh, origin. how did that? Oh, yeah. That but now, what about the turtle, though? Ooh. Three turtles for red team. Ooh. 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 Oh, 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 if if the tiger has other plans with a precard, <laughs> maybe. Okay, there he but goes. Then there what he about goes. the? Do you see? Ooh. See my prediction. Oh see my, prediction. my gosh! What see timing my prediction. was that? <laughs> Did you see my predictions? Precard, yeah. precard for the win. It was so fast. I feel like I'm psychic sometimes. <laughs> but I don't want to, you know, get ahead of myself. You just did. Mm-hmm. You can see the Kali then soon and little over who's gonna. Oh, he actually got killed, but he died in the yeah, process. But he got executed. Are you? He got, he got executed. Got made the, the sun. Even like none of his clones actually got a hit on that Kali for him to get executed. Oh snap! Are you kidding me? <laughs> That's not bad. You can see Johnson I'm driving across the map and Again, then landing on the Eudora Eudora. Is done. He Yep, is done. she's done for. I'm that cheap. wasn't even a question. Alucard was close by. John was okay, like, "All right." Okay, the tiger is actually camping. I feel like Tigreal is actually a really good counter for Johnson, oh, just because will, will you push it he in? can will take you push the... them in. Oh, oh no, he no, no, he got in. caught out. He couldn't he got push them in. Completely caught out. Okay, here we go. Ooh, how did he miss though? At point blank My range. Goodness. <laughs> this is like a storm playing Johnson. <laughs> Right, you know. Sairu is Sairu gone into full burn mode. <laughs> no, no, that wasn't the one. That was actually a good statement because oh, the aggressiveness you're talking about. Yeah, the the aggressiveness, you know. Yes. Yeah, you know, you like point blank range, you know, just in front of the <laughs> enemy, get you, go coward, go go full speed into the tower you know when you're when you're trying see, to see, see. point blank see. though it's really see. not a good idea to use nos it's really see. not 
ఇన్ global the global company yeah, the global yes. and i think pravina actually is actually making comeback over here alucard yeah, the alucard is really Mithra. on is ADA it at the moment is 10 right 1003 yep yeah it looks like zero yeah blue team yeah 1003 like no but then he should be on legendaries right it's just a monster kill is it yeah is it 101 not clear it's okay, so exactly like yeah fair enough mm they're pushing quite well now the red team yeah. it seems mm yeah i feel like the red team model has this in the bag unless the tiger you decides can't to say move. things like that yeah, in a yeah, combat unless, meta you know so yeah, yeah unless unless this tiger decides to get a four or five man really out. good out you know he's going to be getting a huge nerf though again mm-hmm, which is which is very good sound to uh-huh. my ears uh-huh uh-huh i mm-hmm. see why you make it sound like that you can't play any other majors <laughs> i can't play any other majors i don't know what you are saying <laughs> It looks like red team is getting ready to take a lord. Mm. Blue team trying to figure out what they can do though. Yeah. I think this is a bad uh, option just circling around the tower waiting for the minions to come like try to get maximum resources which less is big which is good. Mhm. But uh, I feel like this match is already won but you know i feel like okay, in there terms of there we go yeah only there tig real is the one that's actually trying to do something in this bro match, look at I the spell man my look goodness that's the spell man on khalid he's invincible right mm. now my goodness this how does johnson have a purple buff <laughs> mm. very I... interesting <laughs> the guy it think it seems that this clint also is well farmed yeah he easily won lane against the lesley yeah but let's see how good the buff lex lesley actually is this eudora really doesn't have a chance in this match do <laughs> johnson doesn't seem to like her at yeah, all yeah this, this johnson okay alcar is a level 15 Okay. Looks like they might wait for the 12 minute lord it seems like the way they're stalling this. The Alka just went. There comes it. another oh. pulse from the Tigreal. Okay, oh. I think oh is it a comeback? Is it a comeback? It looks but this it Kali is like but this Kali is ooh, ooh. hurting. Okay, the Clint is back. The Clint will dominate this I think yeah. He did. Yeah. Yeah. 
he totally did. He's too farmed. Yeah, this tiger needs to alt three people at least, including the Clint. The Clint, yeah. Including and the, the Khalid as well. And they need yeah. to kill the Khalid fast because he's like sustaining way too much. Yeah, before, before he gets back <laughs> up and uses the first skill. Second skill. Is it second the second skill, right? the first? Yeah. I can't we, remember. Which, uh, the first or the <laughs> second which spins around. <laughs> hey, wait, yeah, that one. <laughs> it must be the first. And you can see that the KDA from Vapas Alu is 11-2-6 Alucard's KDA. My goodness. Yeah. Clint 301. Nice. Two, we have Roger with four kills. Yeah. I mean he's farmed enough, you know, he can. Yeah. And I think Alugard is almost done with the blade of despair. To be honest, Alucard is more of an early game and mid game hero than a late game hero. But yeah, if he's fed yeah, like this he... then yeah, yeah, because of the CC weakness. Mm-hmm. <laughs> exactly. But the Tiger CC You can and see Johnson <laughs> going in for a crash. He took okay, someone in the go. car. He took Alu in the car, actually. Okay, they Wait, crashed in crash? top lane. How did he crash? <laughs> oh, he crashed the mid. I think they are waiting for... I think no, yeah, they are waiting for crash with the load. Hmm, like, probably. Yeah. They are very calculated, you know? For this, yep, like, yep. this game is quite calculated. Mm -hmm. Which is uh, very nice get, you, to see, I have to say. You, you get Prosal vibes from this, you know, calculated attack. Of course. Like Prosal. Mm -hmm. Exactly okay, like Prosal, yes. There goes Clint. Oh no, it looks like Kali dove way okay. too far into that tower. Okay. Clint seems to be going for oh a Oh my god. Yes. Okay, seven. Oh, and then okay, seven. seven. Ooh, Ooh and nice. Going to the wind, going to Pravina yeah. Electricals. I Clint lost my words there also. Uh, yeah, I guess Clint is the MVP. That's savage. Let's see. Is, it, is it? Let's see. No, is it? no, it's Alucard MVP. I mean, he really did carry the match. Yeah, but did. Clint with the 801 KDA. Nice. Okay, that was GG. And we are going back into the rosters and I guess we'll be taking a break and returning to you guys with the second match. Yeah, we'll be going to a break and we'll come back with the second match in a few minutes. Yes, we'll be right back, guys. Red Bull gives you wings. And welcome back, guys. We are on to match number two. Pravina Electricals versus Global System Solutions. Sahiro. What do you okay. have to say about our dear player, Sashi? <laughs> okay, I think we have made a small <laughs> error in calculations. So, I think Kitty Nona will not be <laughs> calling you for recruitment. <laughs> and I think Berry and Kido will actually be getting recruitment uh, letters from Kitty Nona over here for the girls <laughs> to know. We'll see, we'll see how, how, how the... Uh, you know, the yes, playing folks, we are on in this match. She'll, she'll, yeah, she'll, be, she'll be watching, and then and then only she'll consider. Uh, yeah, <laughs> and speaking of the last game, I think it was a very intense match, but towards I the end, like it was Pravina pretty one sided. played very well, yeah. Yeah, towards the end, mm -hmm. it was very one sided, but 
at the start it was like even but while the clinton daluga got farmed it was like gg like that, that was, was the yeah end. that was a real gg you didn't see yeah. eudora rotating much either and, be- and mostly because the johnson was targeting her so much <laughs> yep. okay i and guess we can go into the second match right yes let's see what the draft pick is going to look like Again, okay, we I'm see the veil band. This time we are okay. choosing the Nana band. Okay, it is the Nana band. It is the Nana band. <laughs> and in you case you did not it, Nana team actually won. <laughs> Nana team actually won. In case you did That's not. That's very true. That's very true. <laughs> okay, this time, Praveen Electrical is going with the same band. I think they actually banned veil and pocket doll last game, as I remember. and global system solutions going for the Banning nana band the I, think. Nana first. i think because the nana was pretty annoying for them last game and the johnson i feel like the johnson annoying. yeah the johnson was more annoying than the nana i think okay, they actually decided to ban two heroes mm-hmm. which praveen electrical actually used last game so they might have to go for new picks this time mhm i'm wondering why they didn't ban clint though at least hmm <laughs> Hmm. Because once hmm. the Clint gets farmed, you know, it seems that Kravina Electricals is going with the Eudora for this match. Hmm. Hmm. And Global System Solutions will be picking up on the Roger one more time, and along the with the Sun. Yeah, the Sun. You mean the Sun? <laughs> you mean the Sun? <laughs> okay, I get it. Oh no, again. no wait. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Same so same pick, right? Yeah. Yeah. Same pick. Except they, basically, but, Pravina Electrical yeah. taking Red Team's Eudora away from them. Yeah. Though. And the Leslie away from them. They're actually picking the. That makes from, no sense to me. Yeah, like, why wouldn't <laughs> they go for the Clint? Because you know the Clint is actually better. Yeah. They actually took away the Leslie from them. You know because. Mm. Global systems solutions use the less they ask it. Interesting. Yeah, so basically they took away the mage and the marks from from the last game, the Eudora and the Leslie. Hmm. But I feel like Clint would have been the better option. Yeah, I really considering think so. Considering the too. savage as well. Exactly. Also, the, this is a very nice savage taken by the Clint. Your team. Oh, that's true too. Oh. And you oh, see red yeah. team here banning out a Uranus and the Moscow and not team. banning yep. the Clint. I'm not banning the Clint. See this is mm. <laughs> honestly very strange to me. Mm-hmm. Oh, you can see oh. red team picking up a Brory. That's a really good pick actually. Yes, yes. Against the Leslie also that's a good pick. And 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 against the Alucard and also the Kali because of the stun the cross range Mm, that's like, also true. Yep. Yeah, and also the cooldown is actually pretty low on Brody stuff. So. Oh, you can see red team picking up on the Sicilian. That's oh, a very no. good pick. Oh no, Kitty Nana's favorite hero this is. <laughs> well, if we are in a late game meta, so you might as well use a late game mage. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> mm. Pretty true. Pretty true. Mm-hmm. You can see the blue team has picked up a Barat tank. I want to see how that goes. Yeah, it is a Barat tank. Yep. Okay, Khalid. Khalid actually did pretty well last game. He did. His sustain was really, really good. Yeah, this, in the, the, the lane late pressure, game. the sustain, the kills. Mm-hmm. Like overall, I think that was a very good offline gameplay by the Khalid last game. Yes. I think so too, and the Johnson was always there helping the Khalid as well. Yeah. Clint, of course, needed no help at all because he just had complete lane dominance. <laughs> yes, very true, very true. And we can see your next recruit, the Eudora. You, you better keep your eyes on. <laughs> yes, the mage man wants to recruit another mage man. Yes. Hmm. So. Hmm. You never know if she is a mage main. What if she is playing adjusting to the team? Hmm. I see. And it's not. And and it's not like you play mage only. You play tank also, right? At this tank, 
Is this then? Rafa? <laughs> Tigreal? Pritchett? Tigreal? <laughs> Akai? Oh my gosh, yeah, I'm such a pro Akai, right? So you just mm-hmm. like your Akai. <laughs> Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> and we yeah, see match number mine, two starting outside waiting for a gang and an invade <laughs> okay this actually Alucard. yeah this Rodi has the upper hand on the bottom lane because yep. of the damage and I Alucard think the going had, for uh, Kamal and I think Alucard did secure the Kamal yeah. Yeah. he got the Kamal okay, like there was no contest Ooh, first blood oh, on the Sicilian your, taken the, right away. By your next recruit. <laughs> I mm. really like the way this Alucard plays because he plays such an aggressive early to mid game and mm. plays very carefully in the late game. It's it's honestly, it's a very pro. Like he has good, he knows when to go, when to not go. Like, you know, I like mm. that kind of. In other happening. words, in other words, he has common sense. <laughs> that there we go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> common sense on when to when to initiate and when not to initiate. And you see Sun using his sprint and running away from the fair for his dear life. <laughs> okay, what's the that that looking for that was, yeah, for the stack, right? I think the yeah. parents didn't want to lose the stacks. Ah, oh, that's also there, yeah. yes. <laughs> But he lost way too much health now doing that. Yep. Yeah. Okay, who, wait, who was that? That was the Roger, right? Okay, Roger camping to steal the turret. Yep. Yep. Where is the Tigre? Oh, there he is. Okay. It looks like the. Blue team has the turtle. Okay, the Roger. Or oh, is it the Roger? No. no, it was not the Roger. It was the Alucard taking the turtle going over to the blue team. Roger mm, running Blue team looking to engage. Tiger is not on level 4. Tiger is at a very big disadvantage without it in no, level tig- 4. Oh, that's so level he can't use his That arc. would have been a major game changing moment if he had died. Yep. Yeah, that's, with four people. that's probably oh. why the alpha went for the turtle so fast. Yeah. You can see he's invading Roger's red right now and they're having a little tussle mm. about it. And, and also, My again, Roger a hard time. <coughs> what was the Magyamo for was it for the engage? <laughs> yes. <laughs> hmm. I think the Alucard heard the Magyamo and decided to retreat. retreat. <laughs> hmm. I like how this Barats really likes to play with the car lead. Like mm-hmm. and only the car lead. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm and, saying? Yep. And also Barats might have to recall Considering the I don't think mana. he's going to. He's Look probably working on his guardian helmet. Look at the mana, <laughs> oh, see? he has to see? recall. Okay, yeah. Like the uh, psychic did it again. <laughs> Khalid <laughs> picking up <laughs> on a blade of Hepta. Did Brody mm-hmm. just use his alt, by the way? Yes, yes, he did. Um, and I'm still wondering why he did that. Yes. I... Why? <laughs> why? Why? <laughs> Alucard going for Kamal. Mm. Sicilian stacking up. I have to say this. The mage in uh, Global System Solutions, he plays very passive, doesn't roam, and only stays in mid lane. Mm. Uh, maybe he's Do you notice that? And when something is happening, he spams kills like crazy. Sicilian running somewhat low on mana, but he does have the impure rage emblem. Hmm. Alucard looking for an engage, but that's okay, already the engaging. To get the Brody, <laughs> Ooh, the yes, he did. And there's no one to follow up the type. No, yep, there's no one to follow up the type. Who altered in Yeah, uh, I don't think Raja will be anything. Do we? Do anything about you see anything what happened it. there, right? Like Eudora is rotating with the hyper. Yeah. <clears throat> so and uh, is not. Yes. Blue team has slain I feel like that's a very big disadvantage, you know, for the yep. red. Doesn't rotate. 
this is like kidding on a playing Cecilio, except <laughs> the rotation. <laughs> Am I right? Am I right? Except yes. the rotation, I, I put that in there. Except the rotation. <laughs> Except the rotation, I put that in there. How sweet, that in there. Cyrus. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just because I don't know any other playing Cecilia on this list. I have to put your name in there. I see. Okay, you see the Brody going in for the ult again after only landing one basic attack on the list. Yeah. I think I think he doesn't know the mechanic of the Brody ult. The hero. Oh, oh, oh. That's the mechanic. That's very unfortunate what just happened to Brody. He did not, uh, he did not have we explain it to our viewers what, what Brody's ult actually does and why it's important not to use it when Leslie has full health. <laughs> Let's go for it, Cyro. <laughs> Wait, I'm still waiting for your explanation. Oh, you're waiting for my explanation. Yeah. Yes, the 10k match MM man is waiting for an explanation from a mage man. Okay, okay, all right. Let's let's do let's this. Go. <laughs> so the thing. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's go. That, that that's just that's just basic. Read the skill knowledge. <laughs> Read the description knowledge. Okay, I think like this is lagging, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Are they asking for, for pause, though? Are they? I don't think they are. Okay. In They're case anyone is wondering. Okay, let's just put this out there. In case anyone is wondering. We don't have control over the pause. <laughs> we really don't. <laughs> we really don't. That's we wish we red did. <laughs> we wish we did. Very true. And again, yep. the red buff has been stolen by the alpha. Well, it's an and easy raid, you know. The Leslie and the, the mage. If the the Dora trying, trying to sneak yes. the turtle off from the Alucard, from their own team. <laughs> I like how and, Oh, uh, no, they actually... Well, well, we still need technique. to explain Brody's skills, though. Six, six. Yeah, okay. Not the skill, I meant the alt and why it's important not to alt with Leslie as full health. No, actually, I mean, I don't care. She can be full health as long as she's marked, you know? <laughs> yeah. She won't be full health if she's marked. Unless she's that's at also the true. <laughs> that's, that's like, that should come. Kitty, no, no, Kitty, no, no, logic it one, shouldn't be one. about whether she's full health or not. It's about whether she's marked. <laughs> yeah. And also when the... Yeah, yeah, so obviously when the Leslie has four stacks... Yeah, it, it's four, right? Max? Is it four? Mm -hmm. And so when I the think, so. got four stacks marked by Brody, the art will actually do much more damage, which is why we are questioning the arts by the Brody. The, yes, we are questioning that. But also, doesn't the range also increase? This is a no bar thing, by the way. Nope, it does not. It does not? Okay, all right, yeah. so. Once you release the ult while the Leslie is in range, it will actually like you know it. It looks like the range is increased, but the, what it does is it, it follows the Leslie. It just focuses. Uh, yeah, it's like a even, missile. even if, even if it she locks goes on. Up, yeah, something <laughs> like a see. seeking missile. Once you release it, but you must release it while she's in range. I see. I see. Well, you can okay. see that blue the team seems killer. to be strategically winning this game yep in terms of farm gank and overall playstyle game mechanics yep ganking mm -hmm. rotation mm -hmm. jungling and, yep and the uh, Cecilion still trying to get some stacks done hoping for a late game comeback I guess I guess so we know how scary Cecilia is once he gets a few steps up his sleep. That's what you and who can play. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Come again. <laughs> I'm saying once Cecilia is fully stacked. Even mm. no, like me can play Cecilia, you know. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> okay, understandable. 
Okay, what's up? What's happening? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He is just trying to go into the jungle. Again, they are waiting till minute twelve to take the Lord. Until then, they are not touching. That was a pretty pretty risky road to the jungle. <laughs> okay, I think he's going to oh, be caught out. Oh, now he's caught he out. Yeah, he's caught out. He's hardcore caught out. So is the Leslie. Okay. Brody going in for the Les. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. Oh snap! Nice. They are actually okay. making a comeback right um, now. Will they be able to capitalize though? That's no, the. No, they that's don't the seem to be able to capitalize. No. <laughs> How are the stacks on the CC? My guess is the sun better go for a solo load once, like two of the blue team heroes mm. die. Some of the solo load. Can soon actually solo load still up. I guess so. he can. Maybe I think he has the demon hunter and another. I think a down. pro soon can. It's eleven minutes in. I think Sun can. It's eleven minutes. Probably he probably has. But you it. know, with the latest updates and changes to the game, it's kind of useless taking a lot before twelve minutes. To be honest with you. Hmm. Hmm. Because the towers destroy the lord so fast. What's hmm. the point? You know. You're just taking a dead thing. <laughs> For the right. <laughs> okay, what's happening over there? Sun actually managing to run away. Oh, it oh, seems that no, Carly. Oh no, okay, they no, can't. They can't to... cancel his heal yeah. because oh no, he keeps going into the tower too much. Yeah. But it's a good distraction for them to take Lord. Meanwhile, Tigreal, Brody, and Cecilion waiting in position. Meanwhile, too late. They are. They were actually. Too late. They are yeah. too late. Yeah, that's true. But they seem to be going in for the fight. Okay, Alugad's life still was. Able to keep him Too alive much. and also get yep. a kill. Yep, they even got a kill. Yeah. Is Leslie dead? I don't Looks think like so. they're getting another nope. The Brody. Nope. Okay, now this is a big advantage for the side of Trevino. For the blue team. Yep. It looks Bar like it's a need. Change to their base. <clears throat> Tiger is waiting for an opportunity to catch people off guard, and did he? And nope, managed to he wasn't able minion. to. Oh, okay, but Leslie's like very low. Yeah, okay, let's keep that for. Yeah, Ooh, but so is Alucard. Oh, Alucard is also done for, and the Cecilia. And Cecilia picking through. up a streak. Mhm. This card is actually, you know, doing the same thing he did last game. Pushing the towers, have prime mm-hmm. pressure, offline pressure. <laughs> He's a good offline, huh? Thirty mm-hmm. minutes in, forty-five k on blue team, the gold, and forty k on the red team. <coughs> and the items, we are on to the items. Uh, yeah, I think the farm is also even with this period, like no huge. Uh, spikes except for Alucard, he's on ten thousand. But but once everyone hits the ten thousand mark, I don't think the gold will actually. I find it up. very fascinating that Alucard has dominance. Hmm, probably for the mm-hmm. budget, probably or the sun. For the attack speed, no, must be yeah. That makes sense. Not only that, actually, to lower their life speed because sun actually Leon's has good life speed. Like, no, but. Cecilion has life skill too. Yeah, and also the slow, like the the oh, item yes. gives, gives the slow effect, like so he can easily chase the enemies. I guess. Yeah. Maybe, maybe so. Overall, I think overall it's a good item for this game. It's very interesting seeing Alu with dominance, though. Just say. Maybe that is the new meta. Maybe, maybe we are learning something new every day. We watch these streams. That is very true. I <laughs> with the Hanabi physical emblem meta yeah. and the Nana pull yourself the Nana together. The Nana support meta. <laughs> and now I'll start with dominant size meta. Okay, that's a good. Oh, that's a very nice different. alt. Yep. Whole team going in. Barat's getting taken down. Alucard 
Now okay, trying to get out of the part. Oh, Ooh. this Rajin is actually doing good. A stand and shoot moment from Leslie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> डिफेंड द बेस I feel like they could have gone for a better CC tank, maybe Atlas, Akai, Kufra. That's true, yeah. That's Or maybe true. In Matilda. the late game, it seems that Barats is having a harder time sustaining their damage. Yep. And so is and, the Kali because the yeah. Sicilian is so stacked. Uh, and a lack of uh, area <laughs> crowd controls. That's also true. No, but they have Eudora and Barats. You know, yeah. they do have quite a good amount of CC. So, an Al coming in from the Tigreal, completely zoning the Alucard. Will they be able okay. to get the Lord Red Team taking the Lord down? They're actually running away after getting the Lord. Will they be able to? Yeah. Will they be able to make but it? But completely caught out by the blue team, getting two kills. I feel yeah, like if they, they had targeted the Sicilian, though, it could have been an easy siege into the red team space. <laughs> oh, look at the damage of Sicilian! Exactly, that's what I'm saying. I think that was a bad move by the Brood. Going in, punished for it when they were supposed to be defending. Yep. Oh, look at the damage! It of seems that yep, that's what Sicilian is going to be taking down this entire team. Just with his stats, a yeah, big, a big group of minions collecting yeah. in the bot lane. Will they be? A, I think they'll minion. be able to take down the bottom. Oh no, they won't be able to. The minions just yeah. respawn. Yep. Lucky Good timing. Blue team. Lucky, lucky, lucky. Lucky, lucky. It seems oh, we are seventeen minutes into this match. Mm. Red team on the verge of a big comeback right now. Yep. Mm -hmm. Global system solutions actually doing giving the <coughs> proper late game medicine. <laughs> and we were very true. <laughs> and we were. Questioning the positioning from the Cecilia <laughs> doesn't matter anymore. I would, I would question that positioning any day because doesn't he didn't hit the Eudora as well. <laughs> mm. <laughs> But yeah, it seems it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter at the moment. Trash. <laughs> Okay, what are we going to see? What is he going in? Is he? Yeah, I guess they're trying to zone the team yeah. build, but it's a very dangerous thing because well, actually they're trying, trying to, to the look game. at this target going to... in for the yeah. day. Yeah, I like that this Barat their tank again has a purple buff. Like, where is he getting all these purple buffs from? Even as Johnson, he had a purple buff. <laughs> Okay, they oh, are they are real. okay. Did you get the Leslie? I think he did get the Leslie. They got the Leslie. Yeah, nice. yeah, he got the Leslie. That's the biggest problem. There we go. God like by Cecilion. They they they, they are making their now. combat. Look at that. Like they, honestly, the yeah. the red team just has to be there covering the Cecilion while he does all the damage. <laughs> they better chase them down now and get the advantage yep. of the kill. Otherwise, otherwise the minions will be on top of them. Okay, here we go. Look at looking for an engage. Okay. Yes, the tiger is at. Okay, he's coming. Okay, they're actually trying to push mid. Fourteen seconds, ten, nine seconds till the Leslie and the 
Barat sama backup. Oke, okay, ya, oke, okay, dia backup, dia backup. But it's so easy. Oh no, they're backing off. Yeah, I think they have to. And no, again, Lord, Lord spawning in ten seconds. Yep. Some time is now. Some time, time to shine. shine. Okay, yes. Leslie is actually running Leslie away. Solo. Yeah. Interesting. Flash is looking for the push while the rest of the team mm. contests Lord. Lord. Yeah, it seems that. Leslie has decided she is not very useful in the team fight because the uh, Sicilian can burst her down so fast. Mm. And it seems that Brody is going to defend that lane, and the red team has withdrawn from the Lord, and are now going to defend the base while Roger stays. Very interesting tactic by the blue team, you know. Mm -hmm. They know how to assert their dominance. Okay, okay. Ooh. My goodness, these oh. setups by this Tigreal. My goodness, me. <laughs> I think that Roger should have gone for the Lisley though. He actually jumped into the Lord. He could have killed the Lisley over there. Just saying. Who got the Lord? Didn't see that. It was the red team. The, the Roger was the actually team. in. The Roger was in Kirin distance. For the list, but he actually managed to jump into the Lord Pit and not to the side of the list. He could have gone the list. Ooh. But the Lord is also quite important, no? So you know I mean. But I think Imagine. was it the was it the Roger who got the Lord? Yeah, yeah, it okay, was the Lord. Like, oh, yeah, okay, what another. is that? What is that? What is that? <laughs> what just the Kali, the Kali actually <laughs> finished the match. Because yeah, I think it's because that. The red team lost two of its members, so the blue team was yeah. able to capitalize, even though the red team got Lord. Yeah, yeah. and, and the, it seems that the, Pravina Electricals has won match yeah. number two as well, first place yeah. going over. Yep, and the rest of us standing and bearing on the base, it seems. Oh, I see, I see. Mm -hmm. Very well, okay. congratulations to Pravina Electricals pulling off mm -hmm. very, very, very good gameplay. I have to say, I'm very impressed. It's, yeah, it, it was very exciting, and we got to see a few interesting picks this time. And exactly. we, we got to see the new meta, uh, which was very fascinating. And that's GG, and that GG. was a very good match, right? And I think uh, that's that will be it for now, and we'll be handing over to Terra from now. So what an amazing grand finals, guys! Two zero Pravina Tech Electricals taking it against Global System Solutions. No one would have seen this coming into this grand final because Global System Solutions has been one of the top contenders, but Pravina Electricals taking it two zero in this Mobile Legends grand final. What an amazing match it was! Of course, there's more matches coming your way in this Mercantile Esports Championship. We have multiple titles happening throughout uh, these next couple of days. So stay tuned with Gamer.LK to uh, witness the Mercantile Esports Championship live. And for those of you, everyone who joined in from home, and especially our two casters who kept us entertained throughout the game, thank you so much. And hopefully you guys will join us uh, the next time with more titles coming your way. We have Valorant, we have Jota 2, we have the Women's League happening separately as well. So we have a lot more action coming your way from the Mercantile Esports Championship. So do not miss out on the action and stay tuned with the Game Royal K Facebook page to get the latest update. But until I see you guys next time, this is me, Terrell, signing off. Hope you guys have a great week ahead.